Hey YouTube, this is Joe of Joe of and today I will teach you how to back up your old, uh, old hard drive to a new hard drive so you can replace it and it works just like the old one, but faster. That's probably why you um, can replace it. So, you're going to need a couple of things. You're going to need a free program called SuperDuper, and I'll put the uh, link in the description box. You'll also need your new hard drive. In this case, it's my old hard drive because I already installed my new one and I made a video on how to install it. So I'll just click here now or in the info box you can click there. And you also need the cable to connect the hard drive to uh, the computer via USB. So it looks like this. I actually happen to have an already uh, external hard drive and that piece just unclipped. So I was lucky enough to have that. If not, you can buy one on Amazon for five bucks or best buy for them enough fifteen dollars. Um, and it actually comes with a nice case, some of them, I don't have one. But, um, so that's nice. So you're going to want to first do is plug it in. You're going to get an error saying uh, it doesn't know what you could read, that you could read it. So there should be an option that says initialize on the left. Click that, then it's going to give you a message, click OK, and then you're ready. Then um, a something should appear, and whatever, you, whatever it's called, I don't know. And then once that's there, you're going to want to open super duper. We'll just say, I'll minimize this now. You're going to want to sit, click copy Macintosh H. Uh, well, in this case, it's going to be Macintosh HD is where you want to copy to the uh, other file to the your new uh, one that's a USB. So, but in this case, I named mine SD, SD for solid state drive. So I would click that and I would save it to my hard drive which is plugged in which is um, buying a toss HD so it's going to be different for you so it's going to be this it's going to be this image going to I believe a yellow image like this that's all you have to do then click back up all files click copy now I recommend you do this overnight because I have a photo of someone here it took a while to do I believe to like five and a half hours which was insane but you gotta do what you gotta do so I just left to let it run overnight when I uh, woke up it was done I was happy and I was running 25 times faster than I was before with much more memory I'll show you right now more storage actually so this is my old uh, hard drive that's plugged in right now with 6 gigabytes free of 278 and my hard drive right now which is uh, built in has 700 well I partitioned it I'm trying to put boot camp back on so I really have 750 gigabytes and I only use 419 and it's much faster much nicer so if you want to figure out or watch my video and have to easily install it you can click here to go to my other video um, and as usual, if you have any questions, feel free to comment them or post them in the video as a response. And uh, comment them and send me a personal message. I am tired. Um, so you can do that. Um, and please remember to rate, comment, subscribe. I hope you enjoyed. And thanks for watching, guys.